We started in 1911. Uh, my granddad farm, started farming down the road after he moved from here from Holland. And then my granddad bought this place in 1929. We milk 350 cows here, um, all under VMS robots. So we, we have five VMS robots and we did separate them. Uh, the, the loop stalls were built specifically for the cows. So we, we do keep the Holsteins and jerseys separate. We decided to go with guided flow. Uh, it just made a lot more sense to me. And it seems like we've got a lot less fetch cows. Um, I think the cows learn the system a little bit better. Uh, we had a ton of labor issues. The first thing that got me was how clean they stay. I, I really like cleanliness. And uh, the second reason is that I thought that the indexing system on these was much better. I'd heard some complaints from other robot owners that they struggled with jerseys and I'm nearly 50% jersey. So I wanted something that was gonna work for, for more than one size cow. And the, the, the local dealership with De Laval, I, I was already working with them and I like working with them too, so. And one of the reasons I like these robots too is that we could do grain only. The grain only, we allowed the cows to go through for about two weeks until the majority of the herd was going through. We just left all the gates open. They could just go in on their leisure. We're still milking them in the parlor. And uh, we were advised to get all the family members and friends down here. And we had a big a bunch of food ready and an ice chest and everything else. And we turned the jerseys on and they just started going through and getting milked and we're like, that was pretty, I mean, obviously there were cows that were issues, you know, but it wasn't anything like I was expecting. That's utter health. Uh, the incidence of treated mastitis that we're seeing is way less than before. We've seen a dramatic decrease in the amount of mastitis drugs that we use here. There is some versatility with that, with Delpro that you can create your own reports, like I've got one in there, it's Jason's report, right? It's got the days in milk, days bread, you know, it's basically the report that I use on, you know, decisions for a lot of stuff, but, and, and De Laval support helps me with that too. Well, a lot of the guys that, at De Laval I've been working with most of my life, I mean, and I always like the install jobs. Everything I've had installed from, from De Laval, it's clean, it's tight, you know, but you never see any wires hanging out. You never see any shoddy work. And that, that was one of the reasons I went with them. I would spend a lot of time learning the robots as they're being installed. I would be very active in the installation process and ask tons of questions to the guys that are putting them in because that's where you get your education 